If you have daughters or granddaughters in the ages 4 to 13 age group, you've probably heard about the Ever After High Dolls. It seems like every birthday or holiday gift list I get these days from my granddaughters Elaine, Jesse, and Waverly has a request for a Raven Queen or a Darling Charming. Basically, these are a series of dolls based on fairy tale characters. There are also Ever After High books and videos about these dolls and their adventures. Trying to understand the Ever After High universe was a little confusing at first, so I've put together these two short summaries to help other moms and grandmas understand what's going on here. First of all, Ever After High itself is a boarding school for teenagers whose parents are fairy tale characters like Snow White, Rapunzel, Alice in Wonderland, and some others. Many teachers are also fairy tale characters like Professor Pied Piper, Professor Rumpelstiltskin, and Coach Gingerbread Man. The school's headmaster is Milton Grimm, named after Grimm's fairy tales. The school itself is located in fairy tale world and it has the motto where princesses are powerful. The princesses are also very pretty, of course, because princesses are always pretty. Or at least that's what my granddaughters tell me. And the princesses and a few princes are also very plentiful, with over 20 dolls available so far. Each of them has their own story, habits, and special abilities. Generally speaking, they can be divided into two categories called royals and rebels. The royals believe that they have to follow in their fairy tale parents' footsteps, whether it's good or bad, so that their stories will remain alive forever. They're happy with that, and they also believe that if they don't follow their destiny, their stories will vanish, and so will they. That puts them in agreement with the headmaster, Milton Grimm. The rebels, on the other hand, want to choose their own destiny, regardless of who or what their parents are, or what the consequences will be. If that means that they and everyone in fairy tale world disappears, then so be it. And that's the main conflict between the two groups. So who are the royals? The main royal is Apple White. As you might expect, she's Snow White's daughter, and she's hoping for a happy ever after life. Pretty and popular, she's a natural leader. Also in the royal clique are Alice in Wonderland's son, Alistair Wonderland, Cinderella's daughter, Ashlyn Ella, Goldilocks' daughter, Blondilocks, and Sleeping Beauty's daughter, Briar Beauty. Not all of the royals have such well-known parents. There's also Bunny Blank, the daughter of Alice in Wonderland's White Rabbit, and Duchess Swan is the daughter of Swan Lake's Swan Queen. Fabel Thorne's mother is the Dark Fairy from Sleeping Beauty. Rounding out the current set of royals are Rapunzel's daughter Holly O'Hare, the Queen of Hearts' daughter Lizzie Hearts, and King Charming's son Dexter Charming. And now for the Rebels. 